Science, a lot of times, is a, is a class that kids struggle with. And most of that is they haven't ever really had a chance to engage in the subject areas. A lot of times, science is very intimidating to kids, and they shut down. When we introduce the ocean to them, and real, relevant topics in the ocean, and current research, and scientists, and ocean animals, their eyes just light up, and they can't get enough. They're sponges. We have created online courses that include high-definition imagery, and video, and interactive opportunities where students or anyone interested can participate in the online course. So our courses are very up-to-date, very fresh, they're not 10 years behind. We can really update our courses with fresh and novel content based on scientific research. And I like things that'll challenge me and that'll kind of be visual and hands-on to where I can understand it more. Particularly Ocean First allows us to open a door for a kid that they didn't even know was closed. And just understanding that anything that we do to the ocean also affects a different life. And we should just start taking care of it now before it's too late. It does play a big role in the health of the earth, which is something that clearly we all need. So to be able to educate kids about the ocean and the general public, I think is critical. And it's the perfect way to do it. It's the perfect context with which to, to teach kids. For teachers specifically, we want to get them comfortable teaching marine science because not every college offers marine science courses for teachers. So when people get access to information, they're much more fulfilled and they're much more likely to go forward and be ambassadors and care because they understand it more. The students today are the future and the more they know about their impact on the world and on the ocean, the better off we are in the future. It's about engaging kids, because that's where our kids are now. Our kids are all about engagement. That's why they're on their phones 24 hours a day, because that is engaging them. So conversations have to turn to how do we make the subjects more engaging.